I was 17 years old when I first came to, to Billings, Montana as an exchange student. Uh, I went to Billings West, uh, where I met with my wife now, Nancy, and uh, we started dating in high school and continued the relationship after I went back home. And um, it was kind of lack of the draw that I ended up here in Billings and uh, um, having to meet Nancy and come back to Montana to, to practice medicine. I was inclined to do family medicine before I even knew that family medicine was a, a career choice in medicine. And once I started with medical school and seeing the different options, I felt very, very comfortable with the, the diversity of things that family doctors take care of. As you become a family doctor and you get involved in the day-to-day -day treatment of patients, the most rewarding thing for me is just, uh, after 20 four years of practice has been part of like a family where I took care of, you know, the baby when he was, the mom when she was pregnant, that baby when he was born, seeing that kiddo going through, through school, elementary school, high school, into college. And I had patients that I had delivered and now they were pregnant and I delivered their babies. I've been able to take care of like a four to five generations of uh, families, you know, which is I mean, extremely rewarding and also adds a lot of understanding of, you know, why one member may be feeling something when you know the history from the rest of the family. Sometimes you just expect one family doctor or primary care doctor should take care of everything that the patient needs from an emotional, social, financial, uh, nutritional you know, standpoint. So the beauty of Riverstone is I'm able to practice medicine with a team of people that have helped me identify all those other factors that can affect the patient's health and has some resources to address those, those uh, needs.